Hello guys, David Race Wilson here. So I do get this question quite a number of times. Um, you know, people asking me to teach them how to do a CV. And um, in the last video, in my last video, the hiring manager advised that the CV should have a maximum of two pages. So people do ask me, so how can you squeeze all your experiences, your education, your skills, everything into just two pages? Well, um, it's very possible. Um, a lot of people are doing it. I did it and in this video I'll teach you how to do that using your mobile phone and it's quite easy to do um, Let's get started All right, guys, I'm on my phone right now. Let me show you the app I use in making my CVs. The name of the app is Resume Builder Go to Job. You can get it on the Play Store or the App Store. Um, this is how the icon looks like. So um, let's just open it. When you download it for the first time, um, you see something like this, and it will take you to uh, an initial app tour. But I don't have time for this tour. So, uh, let me just show you how to fill the various sections of this um, app. But you need to know that there are several apps out there you can use to make CVs. But I like to use this one because this one works perfectly for me. Uh, so to change your picture or to add a picture, just click on this photo icon and you choose a picture from your library or you snap a new picture from your camera. So uh, I already have this picture. I like to use this. And to fill in the various sections of your CV, click on fill in resume and then you can decide to choose which section appears on the cv and as you can see on the screen um this middle bar or this middle rectangle which um which uh, divides the two sections you know the sections below are kind of faint and then the sections above are you know kind of deep uh, so yeah to add a section just click on the part or the section that you want to add and then to fill in the sections just click on the section and then add details to um, the various subsections of that section so um, after that you click on save you do the same thing for summary you do the same thing for work experience um, with work experience as you can see on the screen you can add a number of work experiences that you want but i like to keep mine at three and with the page break you add it depending on the kind of template that you use i will explain it later um, i don't want to add projects to my cv so i just click on edit but before that um, let me show you how it will look like so as you can see on the screen it means that my cv will have these sections personal details summary work experience education courses and certifications language skills references qr code interests and then projects so this actually the templates i like using and you only get this template if you make payment of five dollars a one-time payment of five dollars and you get a whole lot of templates you can choose from but this is my favorite so you can see the various sections and as you can see there's projects here like i said i don't like projects so i just go back and then click on edit and then remove projects delete it that's it then click on save and then when you go to choose section i mean choose templates you can decide to choose whichever template you want you can choose um, any template you think you like and then you can click on the editor and then choose whichever color you want um, you can choose whichever color let's say you choose red uh, so if you can you can see the um, the writings have changed into red uh, you can choose um, let me stick to my blue so it's very easy to use so after filling in every section of your cv and then after choosing the templates you want you have to look at the preview of the cv so as you can see on the screen this cv right now is just two pages and one thing i like about this cv is that when you are filling in the sections let's take for instance let me go to education let me go to um, my high school at the Sadio college you can see i've added uh, an emoji of a zebra so um, one thing i like about this app is that um, whatever emoji you have on your phone you can add it to your cv and it will appear just as it is and that makes it very cool so yeah i just added zebra because um that's the animal that represents my high school in ghana 
and this other college we are the zebra boys so anyway yes after filling in the various sections of the um, cv you choose a template and like i said you only get premium templates after upgrading to the premium version that is after paying five dollars so after doing everything you, you can email it or you can just save it the automatic version it saves into is a pdf so you just save it let me save it into files and then i want to save it on my phone not icloud and then click on um save um i already have a resume with the same name so i can just click on um replace both i mean keep both or replace it so let me just click on replace so um this is the app now let's look at what i have saved let's go to my um uh, file and then i saved it on my phone so this is it this is a pdf just two pages very very simple and then neat and you can see my linkedin profile nicely made in a qr code here nicely it's very very simple to use this app um, to add your QR code, it's very simple to do. Let's go back to the app. Let's go back to the sections. When you click on the QR code, uh, you name the title of the QR code, and then just add the URL of the um, whatever page you want to add. So let's say if you want to add your YouTube page, you write the name YouTube, and then click on your YouTube link, and then paste it there. It will generate a QR code automatically for you. So that's it. That's how simple it is to use this app and like i said um you can use it to make cvs for yourself and then you can use it to make cvs for people and then make some money and that's what i actually do i use it to make cvs for people and then make some small money from it and i think it's worth it because a lot of people are actually very satisfied when you use it to make cvs for them when you come to my icloud you can see that i've made cvs for some people in the past you can see this person he or she will describe how he or she wants the CV. You do it for the person nicely. And you know, as you are doing it, you keep updating so that you know exactly what the client wants. And I do as I did a similar thing for a friend. You can see on the screen. You send it and then you make some small money. So that's it. This is the app I used to make my CVs and that of my friends to make some small money. So yeah. Um, thank you very much for watching this video. And uh, I'll be very glad if you subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And please share this video to help a friend. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.